What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Frost BBM from I Am Visuals. And lately I've been getting a lot of uh, feedback on my animated shorts. People asking me how am I creating my characters and making them look accurate. I've been using Character Creator 4 and their fabulous plugin, Headshot. So really quick, let me show you guys how you can take a picture of yourself or anyone for that matter and recreate them in Character Creator 4. Now, they first have to have like a really good portrait image, uh, similar to something like this right here for the one I did of Justin Bieber. Um, well lit and a portrait, no facial expressions, you know, just looking straight ahead, no shadows, the better. Do this. So you would just double click on this area right here for headshot, then you download, you come into your files, and select whatever image you want. Hit open. And then for men, I typically do a uh, rough and then just hit generate. And then we just wait for it. Now, here we go. It's generated the face. It's done a, a mask of like the beard area as well. I mean, it's just as simple as that. One click and now the face is generated. And from there, you'll just go in and add hair, add, you know, your skin details. Same way you would do in Dash 3D or inside a character creator for any other character. Um, now they have the wrinkle expressions so you can place those on your characters, making them that much more dynamic and realistic. You can also import uh, props, and I'll show you how to do that in another tutorial. Also in the next tutorial, we'll be leaving Character Creator 4 and going over into iClone 8, where I'll show you how you can apply animations to your character and then export them for your uh, 3D software, whether it's uh, Unreal Engine, Blender, 3ds Max, what have you, you can export your FBX file for it to be used along with the animations. If you have Unreal Engine, there's a wonderful thing called the uh, Unreal Live link, which I'll show you, where you can directly import your character, animations, props, scenes, lights, cameras, everything directly in the Unreal Engine. Yes, iClone 8, your props also work and are fully functional in Unreal Engine 5. So if the door is open and the interior of the vehicle is lit, uh, if, the, if the weapons fire or whatever, it all carries over right to Unreal Engine with the click of a button. So I'll show you guys that process in the next tutorial. But uh, as you can see, just like that, we got a character created. Let's go. Hopefully you guys learned something real quick and then I would love to see what you guys create. So be sure to tag me. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. So every time I drop something or I release a new video, you guys can be in tune and get the information as quick as possible. Once again, thanks for tuning in. Stay creative.